Hello everyone, Wante here. Um, welcome to a, another game inspired from the Mandela catalog series. This one's called Maple County Interactive Training Tape. Um, yeah, as I said, it's based off the horror analog series, the Mandela catalog. A very entertaining series that I've been watching like the past couple of weeks. If you don't know what the Mandela Catalog series is, it's about, I guess, people trying to combat the threat of alternates, which are like demonic humanoid beings that almost resemble humans, like they're a little uncanny and everything like that. Um, I played a similar game to this a few days ago called uh, Assessment Examination. Please check that. Uh, yeah, down below, I'll put the description for that video, the link. Um, yeah, I think this game could be pretty similar. We'll give it a good look. And yeah, um, if you have enjoyed the content that I've been posting the past few days, please consider liking and subscribing. It means a lot to me. I want to aim to get a hundred subscribers on this channel by the end of the year. That's the aim. So yeah. Let's get into it. Attention Maple County Police Department, please take a seat. Your training video will begin momentarily. For this interactive training video, please remain seated. Pick up the remote on the table in front of you and give inputs when required. Thank you. This interactive training video is brought to you by Maple County's Police Department. In this instructional video, you will learn about the current threats sweeping our state and how to protect yourself and citizens from this threat. We know very little about this threat, but as we learn and grow our knowledge, this threat will be removed in the following months. The media has not revealed this threat, and everything you see in this training video is classified. Sharing this information with friends or loved ones is not permitted. Exercise 1. Assessing the threat. On screen, two images will appear. On instinct alone, please choose the image that is the most unsettling. You will be scored at the end of this video. Okay. Beginning exercise. Is that correct? Oh no, that one's a bit dicey. This is very much assessment examination what it was like. Oh yes, that is 100% an alternate. Every time I see my old house, I feel sick to my stomach. Okay. That's a creepy picture. What's up here? Is that like a bird or something? It's like a wind. It's just like, you know, there's a lights on there. Was it car? Which is this the road? So it's on the other, this photo's been taken on the other side of the road. I can't get his eyes out of my head. Creepy, creepy. A bit like the uh, the, the assessment examination game where they had like little bits of lore, but it, it interspliced with the uh, examination itself, which is pretty cool. He was weightless, almost floating. Wait, could it be something like there? Or was it? We were talking about this. I don't know. There's something here in this picture, but I can't see. I'm missing something. It looks like a sign. Dashed from room to room like a puppet on strings. Very unsettling description, not gonna lie. I think there's somebody in my kitchen. Oh shit. Good luck, buddy. Oh, wait. Congratulations. You first. passed the first exercise. Next, That's good. we will learn more on how to identify a threat. Reports have identified these characteristics lack of emotion and uncanny facial features. Yep. 
body language mirroring and verbal imitation. Lack of eye tracking and awkward movement. Whoa. Usually long limbs. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, back to this picture again. I think somebody's in my bedroom. Oh, shit. I'm just trying to see if there's anything off of this picture that I can spot by the light or the floating thing there. No, I've just very well be a bird. If you spot something, let me know in the comments, just in case I'm being a dumbass and I'm missing some shit here. But yes, this is... I think the, the descriptions here are making this photo seem a lot more unsettling than it maybe is. But yeah. Oh? Oh, fuck. Wait, I didn't... I didn't expect this. This is out of left field. Holy shit. Wait, is the first person aspect to this game? What's over here? Pizza? Fucking hell. Oh, oh shit. Come in my room. I fell down. I need help. I need you. I'm so dead. Something. Come to my room. Oh, mom is dead. Yeah, I think I just saw it die. It is tracking you, tricking you. The police won't help you. Play dead. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck that. Why'd you stand up, buddy? Hello, Sheriff's Department. Uh, hi. So, this could be nothing, but there's this really fucking freaky dude that's been chasing my house, I think. <clears throat> well, uh, can you describe him to me, at least? Um, I mean, I mean it's, it's like pitch black outside, but, um, I, I think he might be on, like, George or something. He's moving, like, really weird. Well, uh, is he doing anything illegal, or...? Oh, no, fuck you guys. Fucking nothing happens out here. Just fucking send someone. Jesus fucking... I'm, I'm sorry. I'm just freaked out, man. It's just... This shit never happened. Alright, right. what's he doing right now? Fuck. Um... Huh, Jesus. I, he just... He just kind of... I mean, he definitely knows I'm looking at him. And he knows I'm calling the cops, so hopefully he'll fuck off. But I, I don't know, something's just... Off. Oh, what's your address? It's, uh, no road. Yeah, just, just try to hurry. Uh, my mom's passed out in the other room. I'm not trying to, like, wake her up and freak her out of the fucking day she had. <laughs> yep, we'll see you soon. Created by Form Baker. Inspired by the Mandela Catalog by Alex Kister. Alrighty. That was, uh... The Maple County uh, interactive training tape game. That was um that twist that it goes first person was uh yeah that was that's really well done. I was not expecting that. I was expecting like another like uh game very similar to assessment examination where it's just trying to figure out if something is a you can tr if something is human or alternate and it's whether you can trust them. Uh, but yeah, that switch to uh, fucking first person really caught me off guard and the little glimpse of the alternate you got there was uh, pretty fucking creepy. Yeah, no, it was, um, it was pretty fucking horrifying. I guess uh, if you guys know of uh, any other like Mandela Catalog inspired games, I'd be uh, interested in checking them out. So please leave suggestions in the comments. That was uh, that was really unsettling. Um, that, that shook me up. The fucking uh, the glimpse, and then like when he when the kid for some reason gets up as the alter is going towards him. That was pretty fucking creepy.
Yeah, I think I'll, I think I'll upload this on Halloween. So, happy Halloween to everyone. I uh, hope you have a good holiday. And yeah, this is this is Wante. This is Wante uh, playing a pretty fucking creepy game, short creepy game. I'll put the description, I'll like, put a link down below for it on HIO. And yeah, catch you another time, gamers.